Hello, I'm David Edin, the application engineer of Canovatec, and today in this video I'm going to show you our USB Type-C and power delivery solution. So let's first have a look on our USB power delivery board. Here you can see the CT2600 N2 test chip containing the analog front end for entering the power delivery communication and the Type-C port. Here you can see the Type-C connector. Here you can see an FPGA containing the digital part of the PHY for handling the CT2600 N2 test chip. Here you can see a microcontroller containing all the protocol stack, the USB power delivery protocol stack. And here you can see a discrete custom PMU for handling the VBUS. Our solution is implementing a dual road port. So basically it can act both as a source and as a sink. What we are going to show you now is that our solution will be involved in a typical connection between two devices. So there will be, the first of all, the connection, then a power negotiation, and then the devices will be in a ready state handling some requests. In particular, you can have a power negotiation, moreover, you can do a power roll swap because, as I said, our solution is a durable part. You can have a data roll swap, you can have a beacon swap, and you can handle the vendor defined communication. Let's now operate on our boards. Here you can see two of our demonstration boards. They are both a dual road port, so they are toggling between the source and the sink. After the connection, they are going to establish their role. So let's put the Type-C plug into the connector. Okay, now they are connected and as you can see by looking at the LEDs, this one is the source, is a source in VCON and it is the downstream phasing port. While this one is the sink and it is the upstream phasing port. Now, as you can see, they have done also a power uh, explicit contract contracting 5 volts. Now, let's go to ask a power renegotiation. So, the sink is going to ask the second profile to the source. As you can see, now they have done another power re renegotiation and the source is sourcing 12 volts. Now let's go back to five. As you can see now the voltage is again five volts. What can we we can do also a power roll swap? For example, I can ask the power roll swap. And now this one looking at the lights is the source and it, it is sourcing five volts. And this one is the sink. Now let's ask again the second profile. And as you can see now, this one is sourcing 12 volts. What we can do is also a data loss swap. And as you can see now, looking at the LED, this one is the upstream phasing port and this one is the downstream phasing port. We can do also a beacon swap. And as you can see again, now this one is sourcing VCON and this one is not sourcing anymore VCON. We can then do a disconnection and the voltage is go back to zero and reconnect again. And now the voltage go back to five and this is, is a source, the downstream phase port and it is sourcing VCON. That's all for the demonstration of today. Thanks a lot for your attention.